What's up everyone? We're back again with another beautiful cabin and this cabin is located in Hawking Hills. And if you've never heard of Hawking Hills, it's a beautiful destination. You must see it and it's in Southern Ohio. What's up guys? We are at the Pinnacle Cabin, which is a beautiful cabin as you can see. Now we're about to walk inside and I'm gonna give you the tour. So let's go take a look. When you first walk in the cabin, on your left is gonna be the bathroom. This bathroom is an amazing bathroom with great tile and great taste. This bathroom also has an amazing shower head with great water pressure and all the amenities you would want so you don't have to bring them from home. They have Q-tips, shampoo, conditioner, and everything you would need for a great cabin getaway weekend. Next, what you're going to see is when you walk out of the bathroom, right on the left is going to be the Keurig and coffee station with a microwave, a toaster oven, and even a crock pot. There's a lot of hiking here, so if you find yourself going away for the day, you can throw items in the crock pot or have a dinner ready, cooking away, so when you come back, there's plenty of food and you don't have to wait or go out to the store. Right across from the coffee station is going to be the kitchen, and this kitchen is awesome. There is beautiful poured epoxy tables that are breathtaking and an art piece in themselves. There is an awesome vintage looking fridge, but still modern for a nice modern touch. There is a beautiful painted decorated wall with open dishes displayed, copper mugs, and lots of soap and stuff to wash your hands if you're going to do a lot of cooking in this cabin. On the epoxy tables, you're going to find a beautiful little gift basket from the owners themselves. Super nice and thoughtful. And it's just one of the best little kitchens you can have for a weekend getaway in a cabin. Right outside the kitchen, there's going to be these beautiful yellow chairs. And these chairs are exquisite. They're extremely comfortable. And the best thing about them is they fold out into a little sleeper cots. So if you brought your kids and you want a little privacy, the kids can sleep on these cots and you can get a way to get upstairs. These chairs are also great for nice morning reads or just sitting and enjoying your cup of coffee or tea. Next to the yellow chairs is gonna be the living room. This living room is amazing. There's a fireplace, some couches, some board games, and even a TV. Honestly, in my opinion, you don't even need to watch TV because the view is so great out the window. It's just, it's breathtaking and it could be a view in itself. But if you're trying to get down and watch movies, these couches fold out just like the yellow chairs to small beds so you can get nice and cozy, watch movies, or play board games. Or if you've traveled with a couple kids, they're great for small kid accommodations. One more thing that I want to touch on before we go upstairs and I show you the main bedroom is this cabin, even though it is a cabin, it is like living in luxury because this cabin has been thought out, there's tons of good decorations, and it feels almost like home away from home. Now we've made it to the upstairs, which is the main bedroom. This room is probably my favorite part of this cabin because not only are you up here and is it nice and cozy, but the view is exquisite. When you're looking out from the bed, there's this amazing view in front of you and to the sides. The sides offer great light from all angles and that is great for reading during the day or just relaxing and taking a midday nap. Another thing I want to touch on is there's nightstands on each side of the bed. That way, if you have phones or anything you want to put next to you, a cup of water, you've got places to put it. Another thing that's up here is there's a small ottoman with a nice tray table that you can rest on the bed if you want to have snacks or you want to have just a cup of water while you're relaxing in bed. The view up here is amazing. And if you're sleeping at night, I suggest you stay up a little later so you can see the stars and you can relax and just get nice and cozy. Now we see the inside of the cabin, I'm going to show you some of the best features on the outside of this cabin. When you first get here, you're going to unpack your vehicle and you're going to be greeted with the EV charger. If you're wondering, you have an electric vehicle, a Tesla or anything else and you're like, how am I going to charge my car? No problem. The cabin offers that for you on the property. Super nice, easy to plug in right there, right by your car so you don't have to do any weird parking and it's right there, easily accessible. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to walk across this beautiful hand-built bridge. This bridge was also built by the owner, so it matches the aesthetic and it really makes the cabin experience that much greater. Once you get across the bridge, you're gonna see my favorite part, the fire pit. Every cabin needs a fire pit for those s'mores, all the fun things and fun activities you can do around the fire, whether it be reading or just hanging out, having a good time, the fire pit makes a cabin that much more luxury. Next to the fire pit is gonna be another fire kind of style pit, but it's actually made from propane. This is nice because it's a little more decorative, but there's a TV around that, and you can sit around with your friends and watch some TV outside if you wanna just hang out outside. 
After that fire pit, you're gonna go up the stairs like you're gonna go inside and you're gonna see the amazing hot tub. And who doesn't love a hot tub? Nothing says luxury cabin like an outdoor hot tub. Outside, there's plenty of places to roast a s'more, but when you're actually tired of having treats and you wanna have dinner, this grill right here is perfect for that. You can cook burgers, you can cook steaks, hot dogs, or anything you think of on the grill, and it makes a great summer tradition to cook outside. This grill is awesome because it offers multiple burners with utensils included and everything you need to make great food. This cabin's amazing and the outside is probably my favorite part because it's so aesthetically pleasing and everything outside is just a fun activity whether you bring your kids, your family, or you're honeymooning and you just want a private getaway. This cabin's outside features are gonna make it that much more of a great time. And that is the tour of the Pinnacle Cabin. And if you're looking for a great place to stay in the heart of Hocking Hills and you're not really sure where to stay for a good weekend getaway, this is the cabin you're looking for because it comes with everything you'd ever need for a great family getaway, honeymoon, or just a good cabin weekend.